to join us, beloved? It would be my honor. Welcome back to another episode on Behold Reviews in Gaming and Entertainment. In this episode, we take a look at another DLC release for Marvel's Avengers video game. But this time, it could actually be good with Black Panther War of Wakanda. I always felt that the Marvel's Avengers always had a huge potential with their combat system, but it was wasted on beating the same enemies over and over again and suffers from repetition. Could Black Panther be the hero the game truly needs? First, the DLC is absolutely free, so you won't have to worry about any hidden fees in this one. Very easy to start, but I do wish that the started Black Panther to a similar level like your other built team members of the Avengers. I hate this as it feels like your character is way too weak and needs beefing up and mostly likely grinding in the process throughout the game. In other RPGs, you are introduced to a new character and have similar stats to whatever level you're currently playing at. In this case, you start at level 1. I know that this isn't the whole game, but I died plenty of times as the enemies swarm and overwhelm you from the get-go. Once I started getting tougher, the game became what I hoped it was, something new and something fresh. The environments are lush and what you would expect in Wakanda, very beautiful and very detailed. The game never buckled while playing on the Xbox Series X and was a blast to play in 60 frames per second and to marvel at the crisp visuals at the same time. Black Panther's duties in the game to Wakanda as outsiders attack to gain their technology is a simple story at best. We already know this from most of the films. As you play Black Panther, you play as a strategist in order to help the nation any way you can, but by taking on other tasks you need for its people. The short campaign isn't as long as you would think as there is a grind in the middle as you progress through the story. The best parts are the interactions and story you go through. Exploring Wakanda can be fast, but it is beautiful to discover and just a wander. Although small, where levels begin to mimic one another very soon, it is a very nice area of the world to visit as the developers got this part right. The combat is fun and using Black Panther is a blast with his upgrades, supers, combos, and distance shooting with knives all combined to one hell of a rounded character that does feel cheap at times. No wonder why they started him at level 1. My main issue with the DLC, again, is that you do meet some new characters, which is awesome since there's a huge lack of villains in the original game that you fight against, but you will fight the same enemies from the game with no real differences except the corrupted powers they get that turn them red, that make them much stronger in durability. Other than that, it's Avengers in a jungle level. The worst part of the game is the grinding to ensure your power level is high enough to move on. If not, you will need to move and grind a lot more before the story can progress. I love the fact that the DLC is free, but not even Mass Effect's DLCs were this long to complete. The game once again falls into repetition, action all over again. Even the storied levels were similar to the side missions except they are now incorporated in the story somehow. For a free DLC, they definitely wanted you to play two or three times longer, but I must say, this is the best DLC so far. The new levels are fun until they aren't, and the home base of Wakanda is wonderful, and the best design I have seen in the game so far for a home base. Black Panther War of Wakanda gets a 7.5 out of 10 for its wonderful introduction and story that will have you impressed until the game reminds you that you need to grind and play more useless side missions before again progressing on. At least you get Black Panther who is an absolute blast to play if nothing else. That's it for me on this review of Black Panther DLC 
for Marvel's Avengers. Please like and subscribe if you like my videos. Beho out and gray. Take us out of here, and I will see you all in the next upload. The Misasaki. My bonds have grown too weary to chase the mighty Banta to the palace. So you claim. Now tell me what you need. Damn. Uh. Yeah.